Swallows after Soweto Giants, Youngster, Mamelodi Sundowns closing on Mukwena and an update on the Kaiser Chiefs, Amazulu, Sitebe, Saga. Hey guys, welcome to the Wars and Nazo Transfer Show and let's get into the latest happenings in the PSL. <laughs> We kick up the episode as TS Galaxy confirm second signing of the window. The Galaxy have confirmed their second January transfer with Cape Town City midfielder Sean Roberts. The 23-year-old midfielder has signed a six-month loan agreement with the Rockets, with Roberts becoming the second signing of the window after the arrival of Lefa Shlomwane from Maritzburg United. Our next story of the episode takes us to Limpopo as Barocca release two players. Bachaka have announced that they have released two first team players in Namibian winger Jocelyn Kamatuka and centre back Elliot Siema. The club confirmed the players exits on their social media with a statement that read Baroka Football Club has parted ways with forward Jocelyn Kamatuka and defender Elliot Siema with immediate effect. Our next few stories takes us to Soweto as Swallows interest in Chiefs youngster grows. Swallows FC are said to be interested in Kaiser Chiefs youngster Sabelo Khadebe with the Dube Birds keen on bringing in the midfielder on a loan deal until the end of the season. According to a close source to the Soweto Giants, a loan deal for the young midfielder could be on the cards as the two clubs have a very good working relationship with Swallows looking to secure the services of Khadebe. But the Kaiser Chiefs management could face a fierce backlash as Khadebe is regarded as one of the top gems to come out of their development structures in a while. This was the same familiar move by the Glamour Boys as they lost highly rated academy product given to Baddy in the same manner last season. So could we see another young Kaiser Chiefs product stolen by the Dube Birds? Sticking with the Glamour Boys, the Kaiser Chiefs Siatemba Sitebe move could be confirmed by the time this video goes out, but there's been a few developments on the transfer. Sitebe is expected to be unveiled by Amakosi in the upcoming Days. The only thing left that's keeping up the deal is the finalization of a transfer agreement between Kaiser Chiefs and Amazulu. The player is already said to have already chosen his jersey number that he'll don for the Glamour Boys. So it's a matter of time before Sitebe is unveiled as a fully fledged Kaiser Chiefs player. Yep guys, please let me know in the comments below. Do you think Sitebe will improve the Kaiser Chiefs midfield as Sundowns closing on Mukwena? Mamelodi Sundowns are reportedly next in line to acquire the services of Super Sports United midfielder Teboho Mukwena. Mukwena has been one of the outstanding stars in the DSTV Premiership, which has even attracted interest from potential suitors in Europe. But it seems that the Brazilians mean business in January as they have stepped up their interest in the 24 year old. Sundowns have been busy in the current window as they have already added surprise Rulani to their star studded squad. And now Masandawana are looking to bring in Mukwena. A potential cash plus player deal between the clubs could see Sundowns part with 16 million rands plus Ivorian defender. Bangali Semahoro making his way to Atridgeville in exchange for the defensive midfielder. Should the two clubs agree on terms, Sundowns have been given the green light to open discussions over personal terms with the player, with the expectations that the Brazilians could table a lucrative offer that could see the Bafana Bafana International double his current wage package. The player has been linked with a move to Soweto in the past. Could Kaiser Chiefs make a last minute move and steal Mukwena from Sundowns or will Mamalodi Sundowns get their way as they usually do? Our last story of the episode takes us to the DSTV newcomers as Sikukune confirmed three new signings. Sikukune United have announced the signing of Justin Shonga, Evans Rusike and Lucky Boy Mukwena. The DSTV newcomers have had a great first half campaign and now have bolstered their squad with three seasoned and experienced players. 
both Zambian forward Justin Shonga and Zimbabwean international Evans Rusike join the DSTV New Boys on free transfers, while Lucky Boy makes his move from DSTV Premier League side Tears Galaxy for an undisclosed transfer fee. What do you think of the savvy business done by Sekukune United? Please let me know in the comments below yep guys this is all we have for the episode please don't forget to comment like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next episode